Hey guys, welcome back to the Gilly Show. Uh, we're going to do something a little different going forward. We're going to cover, we are going to cover some of the basics. And this is just a quick video to show you guys some of the options that you're checking out when you're deciding to go solar. So here's what we have. Over here, and I know a lot of you guys think I've switched to the other side, but we have this for video purposes. We have a few things we're going to do with it. This is a Life PO4. This is a 12.8 volt, 95 amp hour. It would be classified as a 12 volt battery. This is known as a sealed AGM. Now, interestingly enough, it is a 100 amp hour at a 10 hour rate. So this is a C10 rated battery at 12 volts. This is called a GC2. This is a 6 volt deep cycle battery, very common in solar systems, okay? Now, these are all different from an IFLA cell, okay? This is 6 volts, 12 volts, 12 volts. Now, this is an IFLA cell. That is a single 2 volt cell that is high amp hours, generally around 800 amp hours and above. You can find them lower. People have 600, 700, okay? at a C6 rate, which we will cover later. But this, you guys have to understand the difference between all these batteries and the IFLA. It stands alone. Look at the size difference alone. Two volts, okay? It is two volts of 800 amp hours at a C6 rate. And you guys that don't understand that, in an upcoming video, we're going to go over these C rates again. And hopefully I can break it down better for you guys. But this is what everybody is talking about and coming to the group for and learning about. How to refurbish them, what they are, where to get them. If you are not dealing with a 2 volt cell, okay, it is not an IFLA. These are found in forklifts, uh, industrial applications, submarines even use them. Uh, known as traction batteries, uh, steel case batteries. They have several names out there and people across the pond, you guys, I think you guys do call them traction packs, but they'll come in a steel case and they'll be, you know, 12 volt, 24 volt, 36 volt, 48 volt are your most common. What they are is these single cells stuffed in a, st in a steel case. Yes, they're heavy. That is why we personally pull them out of the case to deal with them. A lot of people don't. They have the machinery to be able to set them and move them around. But we don't, so we pull them out of the case so we can move them around, we can refurbish them and do what we need to do with them. And I wanted you guys just to see the difference between an IFLA cell, a 6 volt GC2 deep cycle, an AGM sealed deep cycle, and a Life PO4. There's absolutely no comparison whatsoever. So, happy soloring, guys.